Welcome back to a new video guys. Now today, this is going to be a really cool video that I know so many of you have requested, so I thought I'd bring it to you guys. Now as you can see, I'm on Arc PC. Now there's a reason behind this because this is going to be me showing you how the mods on the Xbox One will work, and just all the information about mods as well. Now if you guys can smash that button on this video, that would mean a lot guys, and also subscribe if you're new to the channel, that would be great also. And if you can follow me on Twitter and Instagram too, the links to them will be in the description down below as well. So. Quickly, just to say, if you're wondering why, the, you know, the Arc is in a small screen, it's because, you know, my computer really is not fast enough to run like Arc, and because it's just, it's just, it's quite an old computer, so I don't want the video to be lagging, I want it to be perfect for you guys, so I put it in a little small screen, and this is what's going to be happening anyway, but let's get into the video. So, when PC get a new update or something like that, in the end, Xbox always get it as well. Now, when, how things work on the PC is always very similar, or even exactly the same to how they work on the Xbox One. Now, as you can see, when you click host local norm normal stuff, this is where you know you can choose between the center or arc or the island or whatever you want. This is how you change between them. Now, below that, as you can see, it says mods and active mods. Now, let me just say one thing before we, you know, before we get into talking about this. You, we will not have these two buttons here. These two buttons will 100% not be on the Xbox One. Now, the reason for this is because um, the, these are all to do with Steam. Steam Workshop and how you can get mods on the uh, PC. Now, we won't be able to choose when it's on the Xbox One. We won't be able to choose what mods we want because the mods coming to the Xbox One will be, you know, in batch, you know, the top the top best rated ones on the PC. So we'll have them already pre-installed with an update on the Xbox One. So we will not have these two buttons here to be able to get new mods. But we will have a, a, se a section like this. It could be similar. It could be exactly the same. But it will just be below here and this will be a mod. So when we get, so say like when, say if we get like Primitive Plus or say if we get um, the Unaki Genesis mod, they will be under this little section here or any just silly mods like the structure mods or something like that, they will be under here. Now you have active mods and mods. Now these will be the ones like installed already and you can choose which ones you want to play with because obviously you won't want to be playing with absolutely every single mod. You might only want to be playing with a few of the mods. So say if you want to play the Unaki Genesis mod, you click that, you click the arrow next to it and then it will be on your active mods. Now you won't be, say if you're um, like, say if you're put on the Xbox, you obviously won't be clicking, so you'll be using the controller to switch between what, what mods you want. Now, um, if with what, whatever you think, guys, will be like the first mods coming out, I would think, you know, because the top rated ones at the moment, you Naki Genesis mod, and obviously we're getting Primitive Plus before absolutely everything else, and if you want an estimated release date when this actually will be coming out on the Xbox One, we're looking at another few, another few months. We've still got a bit of time to go, guys, which is a little bit upsetting but you know at the end of the day we are still getting them at least at least we, we could not be getting them at all so we sort of need to be grateful that we're getting them and they are going to be absolutely amazing so for this video I thought I would just show you the little section because I know a lot of you guys don't play Arc PC and this is obviously where the mods are and when obviously something comes out on the PC it's nearly exactly the same on the Xbox so this is the thing we are most likely going to be looking at when the mods do come out so it's going to be something really easy to do it's got nothing going to be it's not going to be complicated, you know, no installing, no nothing, and a big question I'm going to be answering for you guys is, are the mods going to be free? 100% free, guys, so don't worry about that, you won't have to go and buy mods from some website, or you won't have to pay with, on an add-on, you know, like all the other big games do. Arc, this is why I love Arc so much, because they just give you all these updates, all these other, they could be like this company that, you know, says if you want these new dinos, you have to pay £5.99 or something like that, they give absolutely everything to you guys for free, and I just did a cheeky burp there, you know, just to add it into the video. But anyway, guys, I hope you did enjoy this video. I mean, I, I'm really, this just video just makes me so hyped for mods. I wish I could play on the PC um, arc because I just would love to play on them, like, you know, with some mods. But I've got to wait a little bit longer. But anyway, we're still getting them. So I, I hope you guys did enjoy this video and I hope it did help you out. Well. And if you did, make sure to smash that button and subscribe if you're new to the channel. And I'll be seeing you guys in a video tomorrow, guys. So see you a lot later. Goodbye.